Double Bollinger's Highlight Opacity setting. I like to use the Double Bollinger's primarily on the highest time frame. The Bollinger's now have the extra highlight color. It's very evident when we touch. Boom. Do we have a short opportunity? Yes. Are we in the golden ropes? Yes. Can we take an entry off of this? Yes. Do I want to take it off of 24 and take 24 ticks of range? Eh, maybe, maybe not. But remember, each one of these bars is worth 24 ticks. It seems like it's small, but it's not. These are big moves. Now, you catch one off of a Bollinger off the top, which again, you have to wait a long time for these, which is why again, I don't say like, hey, you know, take this as a strategy. This is from three o'clock the prior day. This is two hours later. Okay. Do I want to wait two hours for that? No, I mean, I want to take five trades in that time period. But if this shows up, right? If you just happen to be sitting down at your desk and you get one of these, and I mean, you could, you could wait around for this type of stuff. You can, okay. Like, oh, I really like the Bollinger, so I want to I wanna do that. Okay, cool. Take a, take a touch off of that. Boom. Remember, these are going to be a few bars at a time. Usually three bars. This one only did two. That was That's a really rare situation right there. We're usually going to look for at least three bars off of, and I usually want off of a touch, I want to target what? The middle, which is going to be Golden Ropes. You'll see this over and over again. Touch of the Bollingers, back inside, up to, to Golden Rope. Off of the bands, boom, up, touch golden rope. Golden rope, touch, down, into a Bollinger band, touch. Now, I want to get long here usually, but if that breaks, you're talking about, talking about what's your risk. Remember, your risk is always the size of your range bar in our system. So how much how much is your risk off of one of these if it fails? Here is 24 ticks. Is that good for you? Is it bad for you? Again, I don't like to risk that much. I usually like to, like max is 25. Like an absolute max is 25. So 24 is pretty, it's cutting in pretty close for me, but is it doable? Yes. Use of the, the super bands here. Um, this is a special type of Bollinger and we're lighting it up as we touch either side. Uh, when you are looking for an entry, um, you're gonna see me use this a lot. It's gonna be hard for me to show you case right here because it's so fast right now, but when it's a little bit slower, I'll show you this a little bit more, but I will. Uh, this actually might be a great example right here. Let me, I might toe in the water right here. As soon as this goes red, I'll go ahead and touch a short right here. So a quick tap back to a like here's here's a good example right here here is one way that um, i like to use the bollinger bands on a kind of a darker background chart type of scenario so if i'm entering in right here but i want to i'm like yeah i'm feeling good this thing immediately whipped up great we come back i don't want to add here we come up and when this turns green all right boom great Delta spot, cell building great spot on to the add to a position Right, like that. You'll see that a lot. So one little tap into the Bollingers, or like, let's say that you miss an entry. You're like, oh man, I should have taken that one. It would be a great to go. You know, you can chase it, quote unquote, chase it. Just make sure that you wait until you see a touch of the band. Real simple, real simple way to use it. Okay. Press the like button, share, subscribe, and comment below with your thoughts and what you've learned. Watch this next video.